Graduation season is in full swing, but at Plant High School, well, the celebration is bittersweet. The senior class left one chair open right there for Jackie Fairclaw, who continues to recover after getting hit by a pickup truck last fall. As Fox 13's Aaron Mesmer reports, Jackie's friends say it was the perfect way to honor a classmate whose injury united hundreds of them and the South Tampa community. It just kind of became the symbol for Jackie. A symbol of a friend who should be there. There, that's better. Every detail just as important and just as meaningful, from the pink and blue pattern. That just became her signature colors. To the string of favorite photos. Probably the one with the fish. And of course, the seat itself, left empty for Jackie Faircloth at Plant High School graduation, the day she would have received her diploma. It's just kind of a reminder that, you know, she's still there and she's still pushing. Jackie's been pushing since November. She was visiting her brother at FSU and was walking when a pickup truck hit her. It's definitely sad, but I know Jackie and she doesn't quit ever. Not even after suffering a traumatic brain injury, she fought and something else happened back home. Plant's principal says when Jackie got hurt, it brought her classmates together in a way he'd never seen before. And the phrase, pray for Jackie, became something that just about everyone was saying. She's been such an integral part of Plant for you know basically the, the last four years. That's why Principal Rob Nelson came up with the idea to honor Jackie at graduation with an open chair and a few words to open the ceremony. Jackie is almost home and steadily improving every day. And as she fights, she inspires. The message has to be hope, and she is going to walk across that stage one day. Her friends have no doubt that will happen. I want her to walk across that stage and go to college just like the rest of us, and I know she will. Until then, they'll fill an empty seat with memories of their friend and prayers for Jackie to come home soon. In Tampa, Aaron Mesmer, Fox 13 News. The plant principal says Jackie only has a couple more classes to take before she earns that diploma. Right now, she is recovering at a facility in Atlanta. The driver of the pickup truck that hit Jackie didn't stop, but he did eventually turn himself in and is facing a charge of hit and run.